In the next several lessons, I'm going to show you the different tools that Audacity has. One of the best tools it has is the help. So if you go into the menu here, you can go to the help on the web. You go to the Audacity where we download the software. You can find this if you do not have it here. So it will open the help in your web browser, but you're not online. It's looking at a file on your computer. And this is very complete help. I enjoy this very much. But using Audacity is one of the things over here. If you go to using Audacity, it will tell you different things. How to edit, editing things, selecting audio, doing clips, how to zooming. Here it has tutorials. Editing audio file. If you click on that, it will tell you step by step how to edit audio file. We go back. There's other helps here, how to do batch processing, other kind of things. Getting started, take you to the getting started. How to import and play, how to record using USB, other things like that. Effects is a tool that you will use. This will explain each effect. If you want to know how to do the noise removal, if you click on the effects, then the noise removal, it'll take you step by step how to do the noise removal. I showed you the tutorial. Here we'll show you here. References. It will come down here. I find this very, very helpful. This is actually on the very bottom of the very on the home page of the helps. But here, if you want to know about the menu bar. This is number one. This is number one here. If you want to know how to do the menu bar up here, you click on here and it will tell you all the different things. If you want to know about what's on the edit, it will go in here. Like if you want to know how to split a file that's under edit, it's under here and it will show you how to split a file. So these tools are very helpful. The other thing that I find helpful, I hit the back buttons, is if you want to know what one particular thing does, like what does this thing do, it's the select tool. If you move over here, you'll see the envelope tool. So if we want to know what the envelope tool does, you click on that right there, and it will take you to the instructions for the envelope tool. Another thing that's very helpful is the glossary. It'll have terms here, but I like the index. If I see a term or a word that I don't know what it is, like um, metadata, I'll see that come up when you're going to export like MP3 and say, what is metadata? If you click on, you look up metadata and it will tell you all about it. So this is a way to be able to find things um, is in the index. So if you see something and you see a name, go to the index and look for it and it will tell you how to do it.